everyone. Frenzy and Stacy here. We, uh, we're checking in. We've got uh, some sunshine going on. You stop. And we've got flowers are blooming. It's becoming spring. Frenzy really likes the daffodils. I like the pansies. Um, we are having fun. Frenzy is going to be nine months old on Thursday. Yay, Frenzy, give me 10. Oh, she's going to back up. Come here. Come here, Frenzy. Sit. Give me 10. Obviously, she thinks that I mean back up. Back up. Good girl. We're confused. She's confused on what a high 10 is. Give me 10. Yes, there we go. That's what I wanted. <laughs> Sometimes even Frenzy gets confused. Frenzy is going to be nine months old. So I count her birthday. She was born on January 1st. So we go August 1st. Yeah. September. October. November. December. January. February. March. That's eight months. And April 1st is Thursday. Frenzy is going to be nine months old. Or nine, nine months old. So Frenzy's getting so big, I am having a hard time just do, uh, figuring out between her and her mother. Chase and Frenzy look a lot alike, a lot, a lot alike. So they're very similar and I get confused. When I see one run by, I think it's Frenzy and then I'll look and see it's Chase and I, it just happens because they're marked very similar. The difference, how I tell the difference, come here Frenzy, is, I'll do this quick, come on, up, up, come on, come on, up, up, let me help you. Okay, is, do you see those freckles on her face? Chase doesn't have freckles. So I have to see their face to make sure I know which one is which. She's just the same size as Chase already. So that means it's time to measure Frenzy. All right, let's see if we can do this today. Get out the food because we've decided that's the easiest way to do it with her. Uh -uh. Okay, so from her nose to her hips is 41 inches. 41 inches from her nose to her hips. Okay, this one's the hard one. Sit. I'm gonna do it sitting. From the top of her head to the ground. Yes, 32 inches. 32, but I'm gonna try that again because that one's really hard for her. She likes to move a lot, a lot. Come here, stand. Wait, wait, wait. Yep, 32 inches. We got it, 32 inches. All right, so she's 32 inches from the top of her head to the ground. Now I need to measure her tail. All right, wait, wait. I kind of remember her tail being 19. Let's see what it is. No, it's 20. Frenzy's tail is 20 to the white tip of her tail. She's getting big. Guys, I'm not sure she's gonna grow a heck of a lot more. Uh, she might grow a tad bit more next month, but I think she's almost done growing. She'll fill out and she'll get a bigger head because they, st they still have, she still has growing to do. She's not done yet, but it won't be as much height and length. So she's almost done. You're not, you're not gonna do that. So I will try and weigh her guys, but I can't pick her up anymore. And she hasn't been to the vet. so. As soon as I get a weight on her, I'll let you know, but I'd love to hear your guesses. So she's nine months old. My guess is she's not quite 90 pounds. My guess is that she's still under 90 pounds. Her mom, Chase, is 88 pounds. So she's probably around the same weight as her mama. That's my guess. Um, I'll let you guys know when I do weigh her next, but it's a problem. I can't because this is frenzy frenzy this is how i would weigh her frenzy come here hey hey so i would pick her up i'd stand on my scale this is hard so and then i would come down here and i would pick her up and go 
And you can see that's a problem because I can't look at the scale and I can't hold her. She's too big. So until I go to the vet and we use the dog scale that's flat on the ground, I may not know how much she weighs. Because she doesn't like it when I do that. That's not very fun. So I want to talk about Frenzy's or her daily routine. So you guys know what Frenzy does. Besides, besides bark at me. Frenzy gets up, we get up around 7.30 in the morning and Frenzy barks at me. She sleeps in her crate. Come here. She sleeps in her crate and she runs outside and goes potty as quick as we can. Come here. And then she comes back in and she sleeps while I get ready for the day. She takes a little bit of a nap, waiting anxiously for her favorite part of the day, which if you can guess, is breakfast. Frenzy loves breakfast. We eat breakfast, and then she goes back outside and plays with her dad out in the yard, and they run and run and run. And then she likes to chew on a bone for a while. She's kind of kind of happy and active in the morning. And so she goes out and plays. She eats with shoes on a bone. And then they take him another nap while I work. So I work from home right now. And she might do some of this during the day too. Frenzy, down, down. And then we kind of hang out and they go in and out. They go potty inside and out the, the yard all the time through the, throughout the day to play with her mom and her dad. And Frenzy, she no longer eats lunch. Come here. She no longer eats lunch. She, eats, she barks a lot at me. That's a lot, big part of Frenzy's day, huh? And she eats, she eats, she eats dinner. At, she eats dinner at 6.30 p.m. And then she plays some more and we train. Then we go outside and we train and she clearly needs more training guys. She's a naughty, naughty puppy sometimes and barks at me and jumps on me. Spin. Come here. Spin. Oh, you forgot your spin. Spin. Come here. Frenzy. Frenzy. She's demanding. She only wants to do it if I have food. You gotta work on that. Spin. Good spin. Spin. Come here. Spin. Uh oh. Yeah, good girl. Sorry for the interruption. I had to get her to be quiet. So she eats dinner at 6.30, and then I eat dinner, and then we sit on the couch and we snuggle, and she watches some TV with me, and she might chew on her bones some more, and we go for a walk. Uh, I like to walk Chase and Frenzy together. Get back, get back, 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 back. Um, and we walk around the neighborhood we come back and we have maybe have dessert maybe she gets she gets lots of treats throughout the day so frenzy doesn't necessarily need a dessert she likes dessert but she doesn't need it um and then we go to bed at about 10 30 11. back down good so that's frenzy's day so this weekend frenzy's gonna compete in her first obedience trial it's gonna be exciting we're very excited for it I don't know how she'll do um, we, we trained a little bit for it we probably could have done more training um, but I'm hoping she doesn't bark her way through it I'll try and get it on video if they let me uh, last weekend here, come here, get in. last weekend frenzy's dad competed in an obedience trial and did very well I'll put that video on the end of this one so you guys can see deuce having really a good time in the ring. I was very proud of him. Frenzy hopes that she can be as smart as Deuce one day. Good girl. But she has to practice a lot to get there. I hope you guys have a great week. Enjoy the video. And uh, cross your fingers that Frenzy can do well at her obedience trial. Right, Frenzy? Say, I hope I do well. <laughs> yes, she hopes she does well. If she has to bark and back up, she'll do really well. <laughs> yes. Have a great week, you guys. <laughs>